What's going on guys, Jake here, back again. It's been a while, I know. It's been hard to upload, I've been busy, I had exams, Christmas, I'm going to Copenhagen tomorrow for university. Uh, if you want, if, you, if you're interested in about that, catch that in a video coming out later this week about me moving to Copenhagen. But anyway, let's jump into it. This video is about international students. I've had a few of you messaging me saying, oh, I want to know more about Brooks. I'm international. I'm from Italy, Germany, Spain. So I want to make this video to help though that international group of you looking at Brooks because some people in England might not know that Oxford Brooks is a very international place and so is Oxford. So I was going to quickly whip up this video for you guys and let you know why Oxford Brooks is a good place for international students and why I would recommend it to go there if you are international. So firstly, Oxford Brooks takes a, a wide range of ex exchange students. Sorry. So if you're international, there will most likely be people there for one semester, two semesters from where you're from. Furthermore, what even is an issue is there's so many people from abroad that it doesn't even matter. Most of my friends are German, Italian, Spanish, like French, live in Dubai, UAE, Hong Kong, literally it's all over the world. I probably know more people who aren't English than are English. So during the summer when they all go home and I'm just left here, but I've got my, my old friends, that's okay. Secondly, Oxford, one of the most famous places in the world, filled with tourism. So you know that it's super friendly to international people. There's so many international help offices, numbers, charities, groups services so if you are international and you never have and you ever have an issue obviously you know the university's got your back they have the amazing international office i dealt with them extensively so i know them pretty much on a first name basis and they'll help you with anything you need or furthermore there's just people everywhere that can help you from abroad i know there's a bunch of german exchange students who come every single year because there's so strong links with countries if you're interested where oxford brooks has main links with go onto the oxford brooks website and go on exchanges if you're not, if, I mean, if you're coming here for exchange, great. If you want to come here per, um, on for a full course, that's great too. But if you look on the website, there's loads of stuff for international students, loads of um, things explaining where the other universities like link with. For example, I'm going to Copenhagen tomorrow on exchange. That's one of the international links. There's so many worldwide links. There's so many people coming together at this university. It's kind of crazy to think that a university in England can have so much multiculturality going on nevertheless there's societies there's asian societies french societies german societies italian societies there's societies for every single language i think there's like a serbian society i don't even know how many there are but this is a great way for you international people to meet people from your country who speak your language so obviously you don't stick to this like friend group too much be best friends with them but you obviously want to get the full flavor of university so i wouldn't say just be with this one group but they do exist purely for you to meet people who are either older than you in the same year as you can give you a experience about living in oxford in england going to oxford brooks from your own country so that's a really strong like opportunity and it's a really strong network for you international people to link up together so why not take it so this video is mainly i just want to say i would recommend oxford brooks for international students if you're looking at oxford brooks internationally then definitely put it on one of your top ones as i know it's very highly rated among international circles for teaching for experience for courses obviously check it out on a course by course basis loads of the lectures are international so it's really not anything out of the ordinary so don't think coming to an english university that you'd be out of place at all especially not at oxford brooks from my experience and secondly i just wanted to quickly put on this video a few things which i would recommend for you to do as an international student coming to oxford so firstly is obviously visit oxford university not just brooks but the real one there's access to loads of that you can do a tour of the bodleian library they filmed harry potter in the bodleian library so why not go and do a tour of it while you're here that's great Go out and experience the town it's such an ancient place with so much um history why not go and explore that there's castles museums most of them are all free so that's a great thing to do as an international person furthermore there's um easy buses to london super easy so if you've never been to london come to brooks it's an hour and a half to london by, by bus it costs five pounds five well maybe ten on weekends but anyway less than ten pounds uk currency to get to london and back so why not take advantage of that great thing? So you get the benefits of being close to London. You can go into London and you're not paying London prices. So how about that? Finally, experience some of the Brooks student nights. If you come to England, you've got to do some of the English things. Fish and chips, 
go out to the club nights on a Wednesday. There's this big night called Fishies. It's like the place. It's where the uh, sports nights go. I'd recommend everyone go to at least one. It's, it's known. Don't wear white shoes. It, it's known to be get to get quite messy there. However, it's a really unique experience. I've never been to anywhere like that apart from here in Oxford. So it's really. I wouldn't say have any worries as an international student. I would be more than happy to recommend it to a friend. And if you are international and you have any more questions, you can find my Instagram links in the description. Please feel free to message me on there. I normally do a pretty good at responding. If you have any personal questions, if you have any more general questions, leave a comment. I'll, I'll be answering all of those too. And please, if you're international, give this video a thumbs up if it helped you in any way. Because obviously we want to get as many international people coming to university as possible. So the more likes we get, then the more international people can see this. And the more I can continue to help you guys and answer any questions. I was thinking of doing a video on accommodation, but I'm not too sure about that. Um, uploads will be more frequent coming up because as I'm moving to a new place, I'm going to get some new content. It's been a bit hard to do more content on Oxford Brooks because I've lived there and I feel like I've kind of ticked all of the boxes. If you look on my channel, there's lots and lots of content about Oxford Brooks there. So if you've just seen this video, be sure to check out my channel because there's about 20 more videos all on Oxford Brooks. So if you're interested in this university, my channel is the place to be. But if you think there's anything I've missed, Please leave a comment in the description below and I'll consider getting around to it. Maybe there's a huge area you'd like to know about and maybe a few others would as well. So if you'd like to know any more, leave a comment, leave a like. And anyway, I wish you all the best in the new year. And I hope that you have a great semester, whether you be starting Brooks this term, whether you be thinking about coming to Brooks or any other endeavour you might have. Wishing you the best. See you around. Life.